You said you would watch a movie with me two hours ago. But you're still working. I even waited an extra hour just in case you need a few extra minutes. But you're still working. What gives? <sighs> but you still have two days. Two whole days. You can work on it tomorrow and have it done in time. Wait. So, does that mean that it's due at some point in the middle of the second day? Or at midnight at the end of the second day? What? So you have three whole days? You liar! You scoundrel! You utter thief! Sooner rather than later? You still could get it done before the deadline if you work on it tomorrow. How much of it do you even have left? That's hardly anything at all. You could get that done in, what, half an hour? 45 minutes tops? See? That's nothing. That would take you no time at all. Just put it off to the side for a few hours so we can watch this movie. And then you can come back to it afterwards and finish it. <sighs> no. That's not what you're supposed to do. I was trying to tell you that it will make it easier to come back to. As in, come back to later. You know, after we watch the movie. You've been working all day. And I've been getting lonely. I know I was just in the living room playing games. But I missed you. I didn't want to disturb you. I know that this is the best day for you to do your work, since you usually try to keep it open for anything you have. So I didn't want to distract you from your work. They are almost always done by now, and we get to spend the rest of the night together. I was just really looking forward to having you all to myself. Sorry. I know how that sounds. I promise, I'm trying not to be clingy or overbearing. I was just really looking forward to, you know, some us time. Just you, me, something to put on in the background and nothing else to disturb us. Are you sure? Because... I feel like I'm being a little bit too much. I really shouldn't be trying to interrupt you while you're working. I know it's really important to you that you get everything done on time and I don't want to be the reason that you can't get it done. Mm. That's really sweet of you. Trying to get everything done today so we can spend more time together later. That's such a smart idea. I want to spend time with you more in the week too. I was just hoping that we could have like a huge chunk of time together today. I'm just being impatient. Go ahead and finish your work. I'll be good and wait a little bit longer. Just let me know as soon as you're done. Alright? 
Sweetheart, really, it's okay. We can still spend some time together after you finish up. It shouldn't be too much longer after all. I can be patient and wait for you in the living room. We can start the movie when you're ready. A compromise? What do you mean? Uh, don't get me wrong. That sounds really, really nice, but are you sure? I don't think that me getting all cuddly with you will help you focus. You know how touchy I get when we cuddle. If you're sure I won't distract you. <laughs> I won't lie. I like this a lot. I know I'm still keeping you from being completely focused on your work. Don't try to lie to me and say I'm not. But I'm glad that you suggested this. Call me greedy, but now that I'm here, I'm gonna stay right here next to you for the rest of the night. There is no way to get rid of me now. I'm glad to hear that. I don't want to get rid of you either, just so you know. Working on right now. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Oh. Darling, I'm not going to lie. I didn't understand a word you just said. I understood them individually, but when you set them together, all the context I usually apply them in disappears. And my brain just goes to TV static. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna stop asking questions so you can keep working. I promise I'll keep quiet. What does it look like I'm doing? I'm taking your hand for myself. Because I'm bored and I want to play with your hand? Nope. You can type with one hand. It'll take you a bit longer, but that's a sacrifice that I'm willing to make. It's my hand now. It's my hand to hold and touch and play with. 
You get back to work, I'll give it back to you when you're done. Good progress. Like I said, it's not your hand anymore, it's my hand. And I get to hold it while you work because I'm being patient. It's my reward for being so good. Yes, I am being good. I'm on my best behavior over here. I'm being so so patient and sweet. You know I'm usually not patient. I mean, yes, I am usually sweet, but that's a different subject entirely. I'm just naturally sweet to you because I can help but be. You're my favorite person in the whole world, so I always want to be nice to you and make you happy. Hey now, I can quit being sweet to you anytime I want. It wouldn't even be that hard. It's fine, you're right. I hate it when you're right. You always get that twinkle in your eye and this smug grin that's actually really hot and makes me blush. Which sucks because I want to be annoyed with you but I can't because I want to kiss you instead. Well, yeah, duh, but I always want to kiss you, so don't go acting like this is something you can hold against me. Well, you... You know what? Shut up. Tell me you were going to kiss me? I didn't even have a chance to respond. You need to kiss me again. Mm. Fine. But more kisses later, right? And I can keep holding your hand? Again. Now you're just teasing me. If you're going to kiss me, at least quit trying to catch me off guard. Just let me know when you want to kiss. You know that I'd be more than happy to give you as many as you want. I... I love that actually. I do. Kissing you is easily one of my favorite things ever. Yeah, really. What? Do you not believe me? Because you know that I love getting kisses. What do you mean, thank me properly? I mean, don't get me wrong. I know I've been good, but there's no reason for you to feel like you have to reward me.
You wanted to reward me with kisses. I get it now. <laughs> Please run your hands in my hair. It feels so good. Can I put my hands on your waist? I want to hold you close. Just like how we always cuddle. You're mine for the night, right? All mine? so much, darling. Keep kissing me, please. I missed you all day. I wanted you so bad and it was just so hard to just leave you alone. I just wanted to be near you. To be with you. Sweetheart, I love having you with me. I love spending time with you, being with you, especially like this. It makes me feel like I found heaven. sweetheart. Thank you so much for having me. I know I don't need to thank you for your love. It just feels like I need to thank someone or something for bringing us together. It just kind of slipped out and I said it to you because you're all I can think about at this very moment. You're right. I guess if I'm going to think anyone or anything, I'll thank the stars. I will thank the stars above for aligning and bringing us into each other's lives so we can love and treasure each other. Yeah. I think they knew what we were doing too. <laughs> they always do seem to know how to guide us humans to what we desire, don't they? <laughs> now, I think those generous stars above would be disappointed if we didn't take advantage of the miracle of genuine love that they granted us. Please, sweetheart. Keep kissing. Sorry. I know how that sounds. I promise, I'm trying not to be clingy or... 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 Hey, now. I can quit being nice to you. Hey now, I can quit being sweet to you anytime I want. <laughs>